Hello, it's a real pleasure to be with you from West London, from Stamford Bridge. I'm Derek Ray, here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League, coming right up. It's Chelsea facing Burnley. And a gifted, naturally left-footed player who can dominate any match, Kai Havertz. Lee, what do you expect we'll see from him today? Well, basically, you've got to keep him out of the box because he's got such a brilliant finishing ability that you give him half a yard, he will score. So keep him as far away from your goal as possible. And this is how it looks for Chelsea. Thiago Silva plays with Kurt Zuma in central defence. Jorginho plays with N'Golo Conte in the centre of the park. And in this tactical setup, they have just the one player in attack. And this the initial 11 for Burnley. It looks pretty orthodox, Lee. Yeah, I love this formation, 4-4-2. The two main strikers will stay close together. The full-backs will link up with the wide players. The two holding midfielders will sit in front of the centre-backs. Very solid look about this team. And the fans settling into their seats here at Stamford Bridge. We are underway. On to Abraham. Can he find the net? Couldn't quite hang on. Really important piece of last-ditch defending. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. The importance of that tackle cannot be overstated. And he's fired over the corner. But the keeper takes command. Chance to run at them. Teammates in the middle. I don't think in the grand scheme of things he's going to be terribly proud of that headed attempt. Well, heading practice in training next week, that was pretty average to be fair. Now what can they do from here? Taylor must take the lead here and they've only gone and applied that finishing touch well the offside flag has been raised no goal well it was close but he just went a little bit too early well it's deadlock could be a mistake could be a moment of magic. Surely someone will take this game by the scruff of the neck. Offside the decision. Well, they might be onto something. Must score! Well, first rate goalkeeping. Oh, he can't believe the goalkeeper saved that. That's brilliant. He's driven in the corner. Well, clattered away. Mount. Rhys James. Jorginho. And thwarted there following the cross. So the corner played into the box. What a decisive punch by the keeper. And so the first half draws to a close here in West London. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Well, he's got a few things right in this first half, but not everything. Well, no goals for him, no real chances either. He needs to help his team a little bit more. 
just to get involved in the game. I think he would be the difference if he was playing better. Well, the counter chance looks very real. It's a good looking ball in behind. Can he put it in? Oh, a smart stop. A chance now with the corner. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. And he's fired over the corner. Well, not the best clearance. Brownhill and continues his run oh they have it again Westwood and options in the centre Taylor and he could be in proper trouble here might still be able to do a bit of damage We're now inside the final 20 minutes of the game. Mount. Shot attempted. And a fine stop. Corner it is for Chelsea. And now the delivery. Punched away. Jorginho, an effective challenge. Pulisic now, still level, but Chelsea on the attack, near the end. And return to Kovacic. Werner, He's showing a real will to win the ball. Not the pass he had in mind, Kovacic. And all because of the goalkeeper, margins, margins. Well, that could change everything. What a super save that was. And firing it into the area. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. And there's the whistle, all even at the end of 90 minutes here.